C-20 and her team went dark shortly after they jumped into the 1985 ranch. All signs point to another ambush. We've grabbed enough temporal aura to know it's our Loki variant. But which kind of Loki remains unknown? No, the lesser kind, to be clear. Let me see the back of that jacket. Very subtle. Well done. I don't want anybody out there to forget what you are. Oh, your only hope of capturing a murderer. No, a cosmic mistake. That's enough. Lovely. Here's the deal. When we get out on the branch, we're not just looking for a time criminal. We're looking for a Loki, a variation of this guy, a type we should all be very familiar with because the TVA has pruned a lot of these guys, almost more than any other variant. And no two are alike. Slight differences in appearances, or not so slight, different powers, although powers generally include shape-shifting, illusion, projection, and my Duplication favorite... Duplication Illusion projection. They're the two completely different powers, actually. How? Illusion projection involves depicting a detailed image from outside oneself, which is perceptible in the external world, whereas duplication casting entails recreating an exact facsimile of one's own body in its present circumstance, which acts as a true holographic mirror of its molecular structure. But uh, you already knew that. OK, take, take a breath. Noted. We're going to break into two teams, including myself and Professor Loki. Why? Because whoever this variant is, we haven't been able to find them. So let's bring in an expert.